A 13-year-old Houston boy has quite the fish story to tell tonight. He reeled in this alligator gar from Buffalo Bayou. That's not exactly rare, but their existence in those types of waterways is on the decline. And for a young boy pulling in a fish known for its tremendous strength, well, that was quite the feat. Our Lee Felici joining us live along Buffalo Bayou with a story you'll see only on two tonight. Lee? Bill, well, it is right here along the banks of the Buffalo Bayou is where this 13-year-old likes to fish. And he tells me he wears a GoPro camera clipped to his chest so he doesn't miss a thing. When Jake Berlin is not at Presbyterian Middle School or on the mat wrestling, recently he took first place at the Houston Area Wrestling Championship, this 13-year-old can be found this is the biggest fish in my life. fishing on the banks of Buffalo Bayou this weekend. Oh! Jake wrestled with his biggest catch yet. That's the biggest fish in my life. Careful with him. He had reeled in a four-foot alligator gar. It jumped, and we saw how big it was and we were really excited. Like 30 pound alligator gar, it's an absolute river monster. It was Jake's dream catch. We went to the Houston Downtown Aquarium to ask an expert about this fish. So they're really heavy, really strong fish. Um, so the fact that someone was able to catch one that size is actually pretty remarkable. This fish is almost eight foot. Alligator gar get their name from their alligator looking snout and mouth full of teeth. A Katie man caught and released this monster big one in the Trinity River two weeks ago. The fish can top out over eight feet and over 300 pounds. I am still like in shock right now. After capturing the moment on video. This is the happiest, biggest fish I've ever caught. Jake let his alligator gar go, but was left with one whale of a tail to tell his friends. What a catch. So experts tell us that the teeth of those alligator gar are no joke. So it's best to admire them from a pretty good distance or go check them out at the Houston Downtown Aquarium. I really like the wall of glass between us and those fish. Back to you. Story of the day. Thank you, Lee. Uh, as big as it was, Jake's alligator gar was actually on the smaller side at about four feet. On average, these fish can reach, as Lee said, six to eight feet and they can weigh 200 pounds and they can grow as big as 10 feet, closer to 300 pounds sometimes. The largest gar on record weighed 327 pounds. Okay, so our very Cajun producer had a question that you probably have as well. Can you eat them? Well, the answer is yes, you can. According to the Texas Department of Parks and Wildlife, the flesh of the alligator gar is white and firm with a mild taste. We're told it's best to fry it, yeah. just in case you're wondering. <laughs> We'll just go for the mud bugs. I'm with you on that. We have a lot of information on our website about this, courtesy of Texas Parks and Wildlife. That section includes five things to know about alligator gar. You'll find that inside Lee Felici's story on click2houston.com.